this one, I'm going to show you how to download live streams, VODs, and clips from Twitch. You will need DLP and FFmpeg. Just a brief summary, DLP is a program that lets you download videos from all kinds of websites. FFmpeg is a multimedia program for converting and editing files. Two of the best when it comes to this stuff. The easiest way to download DLP and FFmpeg is with Winget. So open a terminal and do Winget install DLP. We'll say yes to confirm. Just to go ahead and download and install DLP along with FFmpeg. Once complete, go ahead and restart your terminal. And you should be able to do the DLP command. And you should see something that looks like this. Along with FFmpeg, you should see something like this. Let's go ahead and download a live stream. Here's someone playing GTA. Now what we'll do is we'll just grab the URL. And inside our terminal, we'll just use the DLP command and paste in the URL and hit enter. And now DLP will go ahead and download the screen as it plays until the screen ends. If you want to end the download, I'll press control C. And now I have a snippet of the live stream. You want to make sure you press control C so that DLP can finalize the download. I have the clip. I'll go ahead and play it in pop player. And here is the snippet of video that I downloaded from Twitch. Let's look at downloading VODs. So for VODs, just go to a streamer's profile page, click on videos and select a past broadcast. I'll select this video. And again, just copy the URL, DLP, and the URL of the video. Enter. And this will go ahead and download the entire video at its highest resolution. Now, depending on the length of the VOD and your internet connection, this can take quite some time. The download is complete. And here it is on the desktop. I can open it in Pop Player. And we can see we have the full watt, which is about three hours and has a size of 3.5 gigs at 1080p. And we can go through and see that everything is playing nicely in Pop Player. For clips, we do the same thing. Simply go to a clip, grab the URL, enter the DLP command, and we'll surround this with quotes so that the terminal doesn't go crazy and enter. Clip is downloaded and we have it here, the 30 second clip in pop player. Next, I'd like to show you how to download a VOD starting from a specific time point. So I'll go back to this VOD and copy the link. And this time we'll have the command like before. I can see that it's a three hour VOD, but I only want to get the last hour. So what I can do is add the option download sections and surround this with double quotes. And for my starting point, I'll do star, and I'll start from hour two at four minutes, zero seconds. And my end is going to be, well, the end of the VOD, which ends at 03, 04, 36. And I'll go ahead and download that. All right, it's done. We'll open it up in Pop Player. And we can see we now have an hour of video. So we downloaded that last hour of the VOD. Let's look at choosing a resolution. All right, so here's the clip I want to download. And if I do the option list formats, it shows us all the resolutions and formats. By default, it's going to set the resolution to the highest. If I do list formats again, for demonstration purposes, I'll go ahead and grab the 480p version. So we'll do the option S followed by res colon 480. And if we play this clip, we have a 480 resolution video. And that's a look at downloading live streams, VODs, and clips with DLP.